All right, everyone. Welcome to Back to School Night with Mr. W here at Wilson Elementary School in Sayreville. All right, I'm going to go through this slideshow that I made for you. Um, it's not going to take too long, but I hope you do enjoy it uh, as I put some effort into it. All right, who am I? My name is Thomas Wanazek. This is my fourth year teaching here at Wilson School. Um, I did actually grow up in Sayreville. I went through Arleth School, the Sayreville Middle School, and the Sayreville High School. All right, I have passions for fitness. You guys know I do burpees all the time. I spend my time in the gym. Uh, I run a kids' fitness programs, and yeah, I play soccer, and I referee soccer as well. I love fishing, little known fact about me. And I also love cycling. I have a road bicycle and a mountain bike that I go all over New Jersey with. But enough about me. Let's get back to the students and school. So with virtual learning, uh, I will currently be pushing into the classroom uh, to, for the teacher's Google Classroom at specials time. And that all depends on what your class is. I do, however, have my own Google Classroom for each grade level. Uh, students have all been invited. Not all of them have accepted, so maybe we could check their emails and make sure that they have accepted. Um, kindergarten, I have deleted all of them. I just think it's going to be easier if we keep pushing in to their homeroom teacher's Google Classrooms. So we'll see how that goes. But currently, nothing has to be done in the Google Classrooms, nothing has to be submitted. They are just set up for if and when we do make the transition into the special teachers Google Classrooms. There will be various exercises and games posted in there, um, but nothing needs to be done like I said. All right, what are we going to be learning with virtual learning? Uh, first off, it's going to be very different if you haven't seen um, during my specials class, but my goal is just to get the kids moving in any way while having fun with exercising. That's my general goal as it is. I get the kids moving, um, or exercising I should say, and having fun while doing it and they don't even realize they're exercising half the time. I also play music, um, a lot of fun slides that I've been creating, like this one, <laughs> and like I said before, all the exercises are disguised as games, and the kids don't even realize that they're exercising. I do bring energy to the table. Uh, what that means is I've always had a ton of energy. I'm always awake. Uh, and uh, some of my friends even say that I don't need coffee. I just like the way it tastes. And obviously, that's a little example of me using some energy. The next video here is a short two-minute video. I'm not going to play the whole thing for you, but it's a day in the life of Mr. W's virtual classroom. As you can see, I am moving all day with the kids. All right, a day in the life of Mr. W. And obviously, I sped it up because the beginning of class has just a bunch of little things that we have to discuss. Going through the warm-up exercises here, I am doing them and explaining them to the kids if they don't understand them. There are days where I'm doing a lot more exercising with them. On this particular day, we were using a slide after the fact. I'm going to forward it a little bit so that you guys can see they were doing new exercises. This video is up on my YouTube page if you do want to view it in its entirety. There is no sound because the sound was sounding like chipmunks because I sped it up. It was a 30-minute video down to two minutes. All righty. And then I think I give a thumbs up at the end. But you guys get the picture. I do move a lot with the kids all day, every day. Six classes a day. All right, a day. In school activities, when we do eventually get back to school, I like to teach playground and recess games early on. Um, we'll see how that goes this year, depending on when we come in. Rock wall. I'm excited for the rock wall. The PTO has been awesome and has purchased a rock wall. Um, COVID kind of put a delay on the installation. We're still waiting on travel restrictions, uh, but the rock wall should be put in this year as soon as that lightens up. Golf. We have a lot of cool new 
golf equipment that I'm excited to try out with the kids this year at some point. Um, it's putting and a little bit of driving as well. We can do it both indoor and outdoor. Luckily here at Wilson, we have a huge gym that indoor wouldn't be an issue. Outdoors, we would make it work either way. Seasonal sports skills like soccer, football, basketball, and baseball skills. I like to touch upon those uh, at various times throughout the year. Um, depending on what season it is, I try and keep it with where the kids would be playing it outside at, uh, during a particular season. So we should see those. Fitness skills. We work on these randomly throughout the year, almost every day. You would have balance, rec re uh, reaction time, power, strength, speed, agility, coordination. And I put strength there again. Look at that. Also, the fastest class challenge is something I tried last year to get the kids excited about running. Um, they practice running at recess and at home. Once, uh, once a month in phys ed, we do a five-minute jog, and I take the amount of laps that we do, divided by the amount of number of students that we have, and we find an average lap per student. And that goes for all grades across the school and we find the fastest class in each grade um, and the fastest class in Wilson School for each month. So the kids get really excited about that. Last but not least, I do have office hours and you can contact me at any time. The office hours are set up in the form of a Google meeting. Uh, it's every day at two o'clock to 3.20. So you can pop on in there. I will be checking it uh, to see if anyone pops in. And the link can be found on my OnCourse website through the school website. Or you can just email me and I will give you the link no problem. I hope everyone has a great school year and I look forward to seeing everyone. Have a great day, everyone.